Eastern can't get the puck cleanly through the neutral zone, and then there's pressure from B. Watch Raider is going to pick it up, going to come. Phillips in the middle of the ice. Quick release. Has it block off the Jordan Harris's leg. Gets his own rebound. This one opportunity right He's not. Harris isn't looking at the puck. Phillips is able to get by him. Sempton felt through the full. Well, two great chances by Northeastern to walking it back to TD Garden. Neutral zone opportunity. Transition for Novak. Drops the left knee to shoulder and the toe, the right toe of Duplessis makes the save. Then another quick turnover by BU. Look at the patience by Hughes. Waits, waits, waits. Duplessis has got to front him, but then at the last second, O'Brien comes in. That guy was off. That and they carry out. Right back the other way. Skating into Sam Stevens. Back to McCarthy. McCarthy fires it and it was redirected wide. Turnover the neutral zone though and again. McCarthy's feeling it. Wrist shot wide to the right. And the Terriers try to make something happen the other way. Heading into the zone. Shot was deflected wide. As Kaufman took the shot looking for Cockrell out in front. And Colangelo may have gotten a piece of that. And here's Kaufman again. Little feather through. Came all the way to the goaltender who had to kick it aside on the... Good chance. Starts with Colangelo. Speed through the neutral zone. Tipped in. A little chip pass back over to him after Fontaine was able to corral it. There's Jackson darting wide too. She's going to try and force feed it over to Colangelo. But a good stick by BU in the middle. Of towards the net. Taken there by Fensori. And he skates up the ice. Here's Brown. Into the zone. Brown fires it, blocker save. Brown kicks the rebound, backhand in a crowd. Knock back to Kislin. Kislin looking, waiting. Ten seconds to go in the period. Eight seconds remaining in the penalty. Shot sails wide. Reese pass just went to. Uh, here's the second opportunity. It's going to pick the puck up off the wall with a little help of Chupani. Goes forehand into backhand. Just can't. Fontaine is up above. Nice little play, a little keep in by Struve, a little swat play. Everybody from BU is watching the puck come out. Brown can't get to it, and Struble sees that his man right down the middle, Fontaine, or Jackson, I beg your pardon, is right there. Even if that one had gone in, I don't think it would have counted as, I think you'll see the stick of Jackson right there end up pushing into play. He's get a real good opportunity. He can play center or wing. He's playing more center in this game. He's able to drive the corner, brings the puck to the middle, tries to go under the stick and through the, the triangle of the, the seats. End of a long shift, they will change up. Terry's going to try to catch him in that change. Here's Tuck with Peterson. Back to Tuck. Down low. Tuck with a wraparound bid, but he is met there by Mella. Alex Mella would have none of it. Jerry Keefe was so happy with how Fontaine played last week. Here he's going to get the pass just quickly through, protects it, and then he can't corral. He's trying to use the right leg or the, the backside of Duplessis perhaps to bounce this one in here. Good body control. A lot of people thought he'd probably go behind the net, maybe bring it out to the other side. By, by the way, B already with 11 blocks in this game, so that's another reason why it's been so hard to get through. But Ty Jackson busting through the seam. Colangelo with the opportunity. At least he puts Northeastern as Miller steps up. Tucks going to take the hit, but still puts it in, but then a good little stretch up, and here is Hughes, and we've called his name a few times. We have called but earlier today, I talked to Mike Condon, the former National Hockey Leaguer, who's now the assistant coach, goalie coach in, at Northeastern. He talked about how earlier in the season, Septenfelter's stance was... O'Brien banging around up along the boards. The Terriers still control here. Left side played out in front. O'Brien trying to get the stick free. The puck sitting there tantalizingly in front of him, and now he has it. O'Brien plays it down low. Shot just wide. As we'll send it across the center line, but not much on it. Mastro Simone comes the other way. Kicked away by Semptenfelter as he made a big save there to keep this scoreless. Turn over here. Mastro wide. They cycle it. O'Brien takes it. O'Brien shot, glove save, lost it for the moment, but Semptenfelder covers up and gets the whistle. An awful lot. Logan Cockrell, eventually it's going to be that left pad of Semptenfelder who gets it and he jumps on that rebound that pops off him, but earlier, both in the O-zone and the D-zone. Jack Hughes got it started, glove down there and played up deep into the corner. Riley Hughes for his brother Jack. Centering pass, bounces around. Riley Hughes turns, fires, and it was blocked. Wilmer Scoob got in his shooting lane. And now Master Simone the other way into the offensive zone. The back. They win the draw there. Shot came through from St. Louis, and it was turned aside. Rebound out to center spot. Couldn't handle it. Mastro Simone jumps in behind, takes the shot. Semptenfelter there to make the save. Championship. 
Pass ahead to the left side, coming in with speed. Save made Simpton felt a rebound up. He makes the save on the follow. Two quality bids. Out front, here's Harris. Plays it to the right for Milton. Down low, they get it through to Colangelo, but it's knocked off his stick. Jackson tried to get back after it, and now it's one on one here, two on one, developing as Armstrong gets it to Peterson. He scores! Dylan Peterson, his eighth of the year with 2.46 remaining, and it's 1 0 BU. The fourth line coming through for the Terriers. Great play by Armstrong to show some patience. Let's go back to the D zone. There's that layered approach again. Peterson helps start it, kicked up. Miller can't get to it, a little jump by. Armstrong goes wide, waits, 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 and at the last possible second, sizzles the pass through the blue paint. Over to Peterson, who drives wide with his stick on the ice and snaps it and just punches it into the net. No chance for Semptenfelter to get over there. A bang, bang play after good defensive zone structure leads to the opportunity to get the puck out. Eastern will take their timeout. There's the McDonough shot. Low on the ice, creates a rebound, and that one just... I can't tell if that hit Weber or McCarthy and then jetted over the net. But McDonough with two chances from that left side. The low look showing you how the puck right there off the shoulder of Duplacis, but yet he never seems... Harris, Harris, seals him off, gets to the puck, 15 seconds remaining as Colangelo brings it up the ice. Ahead to the left, but out of the reach of Fontaine. Tied up in the corner. Final seconds now. Can the Huskies get a shot off before the buzzer? Fun